here's a project that I've been working on for quite a while now in my home workshop, not the one in France. It's a little boiler in which I intend to run steam engines, small steam engines which I have yet to build. I've never built a steam engine before or got involved in any form of model engineering, but I just had a notion to get some steam engines going and I thought that the best way to do that is on steam. So I've got this far with the boiler. It's three inch diameter, about six inches tall, made of copper, a uh, three inch copper tube with five fire tubes according to my interpretation of a design for a two inch boiler by Stan Gray. Um, it uh, has got pushed holes drilled in it for all the different fittings. We're going to have the full range of fittings on this. I'll not go into that just now because um, I'll do another video later on when I've made a bit more progress. Uh, but you can see it here fitted with a test pressure gauge to, um, you know, to, well, to check the pressure with, uh, make sure it doesn't leak and so on, and uh, a Schrader bicycle pump style valve, so the boiler is being air tested. Well, it was air tested the other night, and it held 15 pounds per square inch for an hour without any leaks. I had to mechanically pin one of the tubes to fix a very minor pinhole leak to start with, but after that it was, was okay. So fingers crossed it stays that way. I've just put more of the air back into it. It's sitting here holding 15 psi, and um, that's not a great deal of pressure, but you don't want to go too high on an initial air test. But it's holding 15 psi now. Um, you can see, really, that's all there is to see at the moment various um, bushes with the blanking plugs in them, the air input valve, and the pressure gauge. Uh, I'll, uh, it still has to have a smokestack, a cap and a smokestack to on and uh, I'll go into more, much more detail about the way this boiler is going to be configured when the time comes. But for now, um, we'll leave it there. It's just an introductory video on this subject and um, I'll just let that 15 psi of air out. You might hear the hiss um, depending on how big the mic is in this camera. There we go. See you later.